Ever since I can remember, I was creating something. I was drawing, I was painting, I was making my own stationery. I was doing something that allowed me to be artistic. Today, I still enjoy that. Today, I'm still very much like that. And the mediums change, whether it's drawing with pencil or charcoal or pastels. Maybe it's painting, it's watercolors, acrylics, calligraphy, inks, video, recording, editing, software. The medium I'm using is always changing. Very rarely do I know exactly what I'm going to make. I just get out my supplies, I get a piece of paper, and I just begin. I could easily lose track of time and space and reality while I am creating something. It's so easy for me to get completely absorbed. I forget about food, I forget about water, I am so wholly in the moment and so wholly in what I am doing that I don't remember anything else exists. When I was younger, art was always a way to escape whenever I was struggling. When my thoughts were so heavy that it felt like I couldn't bear them any longer, I turned to art. And art was the escape that provided my brain some relief. When you're a child, you have all the time in the world to create, all the time in the world to make art, to do whatever you want. When you're older and you have children, that time gets stripped away from you. And it becomes increasingly difficult to find that time, to search for that time, to grasp, clutch to that time to create. Whenever my mind is full, whenever my life is overwhelming, whenever my circumstances seem blown out of proportion, art always brings me back. It centers me. It helps me to feel peace, serenity, comfort. Art for me is not just a way to escape, but it becomes a way to ground myself. Art is simply expressing yourself through another medium. Through paper and inks and dyes and colors and fabrics and textures. Art is you expressed in another form. Sometimes it's your better form. And sometimes it's that art that comes back to speak to you. For me, art isn't just expressive. It's not a way to express myself all the time. Many times it's a way of release. It's a way to vent. I think when I was younger and I felt that I didn't have someone to talk to to understand my feelings, that's when I turned to art. I'm not always happy with the results. Art for me isn't always expressive. It's not always about expressing myself it's not always that I feel this amazing passion in me that needs to be put down on a paper or canvas. Many of times it's just the process. It's just the incredible focus I feel that I don't get in any other way that allows my mind to completely calm itself. This is what art really does for me. For me, most of the time, art is therapy.